And today's session, my friends, is all about practicing. Forget about artificial intelligence, forget about technology. Really, the focus today I want is on practicing. Especially when we want to deliver something important at work or maybe even at an event. You have been asked to say a few words. For me, practices like Mark Twain said, it takes at least three weeks to prepare an impromptu speech. So imagine how much we need to practice when we want to deliver something much more important. I practice in front of the mirror. I practice when I'm driving in my car. I even practice uh, in front of my wife. And I get feedback in all three cases. For example, when I practice in front of the mirror, it is self-evaluation. Since I am the author and the critic, I am biased. I will always say, wow, that's great. You have done an amazing job. When I'm practicing in the car, I get feedback from the other motorists who look at me strangely. What is this guy doing in his car? When I practice in front of my wife, the feedback I get depends on many parameters. Has she had a good cup of tea with the right amount of milk and sugar? I'll get good feedback. Is she upset with me because I forgot her birthday? Once, 20 years ago, the feedback would be perhaps more challenging. But in all these three cases, I get feedback. And if you ask me, the feedback that I truly appreciate is the one given by my wife because she cares about me and wants to make sure that I succeed. But what if you could get feedback any time of the day or night, 24 by 7? And that is the topic of discussion. That is to get feedback for the things that you practice. So again, the focus here is on practicing to deliver something. And you could get feedback from different people, your mentors, your coaches, but also an additional tool in your arsenal of improving your public speaking skills. Don't think of what I'm saying today as a replacement of what we already have, the human connections. Wherever possible, our feedback should be always from a human that we trust and we aspire to be. My name is Kajitan Bareto. So we are going to talk about how we can make use of artificial intelligence in a public speaking development. So Udly is an AI, artificial intelligence powered speech coach. So think of it as, as I said, an additional tool in your arsenal to improve your communication skills. Now, who better to explain a little bit more about that than the founder of Udly. So let me share a small video clip that was provided to me by Varun Puri, who founded this along with his partner, Isha. Hi, everyone. My name is Varun. I'm one of the founders of Udly. It's such an honor to be with you all, even though virtually and asynchronously. A big thank you to members of District 124, to Dr. Gayatri Deshmukh, and especially to Kajitan, our champion Udly ambassador for facilitating this session. Our dream behind Udly is to be your private, judgment-free, secure speech coach to be an augmentation of your Toastmasters club experience, such that anytime you're talking, Udly is by your side and gives you feedback. Varun, you're interrupting women more than men, or you're talking way too quickly, or you're using too many filler words. Duolingo has done this to language learning and Grammarly has done this to writing. The goal behind Udly is to give you judgment-free feedback on the way you speak, anytime you speak. Kajitan is an expert Udly ambassador and our champion across the Middle East. You are in excellent hands as you get started with this session. Happy speaking. So that was Varun Puri. I had asked him to record a short uh, message for all of us here just to give his vision about what Udly is all about. And I'm going to expand on this topic for the rest of the session. So Udly, as of now, first of all, is completely free. So those of you who are in this room, please sign up and at least experiment with it. If you are a Toastmaster, log into your Toastmasters account and you go to your profile and you scroll down 
you will find Udly as part of your profile. So you could click on this and it will take you to Udly. You can of course access Udly outside of Toastmasters. If you are not a Toastmaster, also you can use it. There is a small difference between the Udly that is used by Toastmasters and the Udly that I will demonstrate here. But generally, they are there to help us to improve our public speaking. Once you sign up for Udly, the first thing I suggest you all do is have a look at the courses that are available. All these courses are free. There is a course from founder himself. So he has a course on the fundamentals of public speaking. Half an hour is what you need to spend on it. And there are other courses by famous coaches and public speakers. Isha is the co-founder of Udly. So you could uh, go through her course where she gives you tips on interviews. But other than that, there is this whole set of speeches by famous personalities. And one thing you will notice is, for example, if you take up this speech by Zendaya, she is a famous actress, very young. Let me click on that speech. And the first thing you will see is that you will get the speech here and then transcript. So the transcript is the AI system automatically detecting what you have spoken and converting that into words. You can see all the filler words and you can of course listen to the speech. Once you check the transcript, what you can do is you can look at the coach comments. And the coach comments is the AI trying to figure out what is it that you spoke. It creates a summary of your key takeaways. Also, it will suggest one or two places that you can rephrase the paragraph. So in this case, the entire paragraph has been rephrased and you could use that if you wish and incorporate it into your speech. It highlights your filler word usage. It highlights some weak phrases. And then on the right hand side, so here the word choices are highlighted. What are the top keywords? And the good thing about it is that if you want to identify this word and n so it's a repetition all you have to do is go to the speech and click on this button and it will play that segment <laughs> so you can see and and has been spoken you can see there is a high usage of filler words 20 fillers seven percent also you can look at the delivery 201 words per minute that's high speed so the suggestion would be to speak at a lower rate. So that is how you can make use of Udly. But what about us practicing our own speech? Because that's what we are here for. So here we have what we call the library. These are all the speeches that I have uh, either recorded or uploaded or in this case, a Zoom meeting. If you just want to quickly record a speech, what Udly has to say about it, you can simply click on the record button and you can click record a speech open up a window all you have to do is hit the start button once it says zero you start speaking start with a good opening start talking about your core message of your speech call for action and when you're done click the stop button and then click on save recording if you wait for around 20 30 seconds it will process your speech it will give you the transcript it will give you the coach's comments let's come to it a bit later on let me go to this library so it is still processing here so this is the first option that is you simply click on record and you can record a speech and it will give you the analytics after a minute or so if you have recorded previously a speech and you have it on your computer you can upload it here and this is what i did when uh, Varun sent me his speech. I clicked on the upload button and then I could browse the files where I have stored it on my computer and then I uploaded it and that is what you see here. Let's get to the library and open up our meeting that I have recorded from the beginning. Udle, Udle, Udle meeting. Now this is a very interesting feature. What it has done is it has recorded a zoom meeting and how it has done it before i go through this i want to show you how it has done it if you notice on the left hand side there is something called udly for zoom if you're holding a zoom meeting as of now udly only works for zoom if you use microsoft teams this will not work but if you are using udly for zoom what you would do is you can come here and in this paste the link of your zoom meeting click on it and say invite bot that's like a person who has joined this meeting and it is recording this session as of now it can record maximum one hour 
but you can also stop it by clicking on stop recording and it will disappear from the meeting and what it does is it captures that conversation from the time it entered the meeting room till the time it exited and it can do that analytics on it and that's what i'm going to do now for the first hour of our meeting first of all let us look at some of the feedback that it has given us now this is for the entire meeting you must understand so the use of filler words it has been used 16 times so we should use less of them it identifies the weak word usages repeated sentence starters somebody has used so much six times if i go to the transcript again we can look at the transcript we can try and understand whether our words were understood and they were clear to the ai and from what i can see here we have done an excellent job when we are assessing a zoom meeting one of the thing i like to go through and it is available only if you record a zoom meeting is this option called listening it highlights to us who is really taken part in this meeting and each person here as you can see has been color coded so this gives you an assessment of the engagement level in your meeting the next thing you can of course do is you can select an individual person from this meeting let's say our speaker kaushik and then i get the analytics only for that person what else can we do there is a fun section here gamify the whole process of becoming better at public speaking by playing games so there are as of now three different games that you can play no filler game there is a spinner yarn and there is a metaphor game just click on start playing and the whole objective is to speak for at least 1 minute without the use of filler words you keep playing till you get that high score and you great so i think i'm done now i hope you found this session useful i want to stress yudli is not here to replace humans at least from a, as an ambassador look at it as something that will supplement what we are already doing but it helps you to do practice in a safe space without judgment the feedback is visible only to you and it's up to you how much feedback you want to incorporate into your next speech as we do in real life